this little guy. I went to a conference and here's what happened. Don't judge me, here's what happened. I was filming the entire day, I did some interviews and my memory card got full. What do you do? You start copying files off the card onto the computer. I should have checked and I didn't. And I simply went and deleted this memory card so I could film the next day. It didn't go well, the files did not copy. Now, technically, I would have lost everything because, as you know, when you delete things off an external drive, external hard drive, external USB stick, those files are gone. There is no recycle bin. But I'm using a software from ECUs, and I'm going to show you how you can recover files even off external drives. Check this out. Hey, welcome to another Tech Tip Tuesday. My name is Liron Segev, and every Tuesday I share with you tips and tricks and how to's making you more productive, more efficient, and getting more out of your systems. If this sounds like something that you're into, smash that subscribe button right here, and let's get on to this week's episode. Okay, so let me show you how you can recover a deleted file even when it's on a memory stick or a flash drive. So here I've got one in my F drive, and I'm going to create a new file. Let's make it a text file so it's nice and simple. And let's give it some really catchy name, something like this. Okay, so now there's my file and let's double click on it to it and let me bring it over there and just let me just type something in there just to kind of fill up the file so it's more than zero kilobytes so we know we've definitely got something in there. Okay, so let's close that file, let's save it. Um, right, it's gone up to one kilobyte. Let's just double click into it and make sure it's still in there. Great, everything's there. Um, I'm just gonna add these, so we need a file with some revisions, some changes. Okay, perfect, so the file's there. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna right click on that and then delete it. Now you can see because it's an external drive, it automatically goes to permanent delete. There is no recycle bin. Okay, even if we refresh it, it's definitely gone. So all we got to do is fire up the Ease Use Windows Recovery Pro, as I've got here, select my external drive and start to let the program just do its thing, let it run. And almost immediately you can see that the file is right there. Click on it and all I'm going to do is I'm going to say well, where do I want to recover it to? Select somewhere on my hard drive and once I do that, I click on OK and it pretty much opens that file location. Double click on the folder, get to that file, and there it is. Let's open it, see if it's the same file. Absolutely. Okay, so that was one file being recovered. Beautifully done, well done. But what happens if you by mistake formatted your entire drive and then decided that you actually needed something back? What will the software do then? Good question, thank you. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna format that drive and we're gonna go back into it and make sure that it's definitely formatted. Click on it, right, there's no folders there anymore. It's pretty much gone. Technically, that will be in the end of that, nothing you could have done. But when we run the ECU's Window Recovery Pro, it starts to discover all these files and folders that we had on that drive, and you simply put a tick mark next to the ones that you want and recover it to your hard drive. Now this works because when you delete a file, it doesn't actually delete it. It just removes the reference or the index to that file, but the file's technically still there waiting to be overwritten. Unless that file's overwritten by other files, it will be recoverable by this. It's got a 95% chance of being recovered using the software. This is pretty cool to have. Link in the description below. Go and grab yourself this piece of software before it's too late. So this concludes another Tech Tip Tuesday. Hopefully you've picked up some tips and tricks that you could use. Feel free to share this video by clicking the share button down below. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps the channel a lot. And I'll see you guys on the next episode of Tech Tip Tuesday. Cheers for now.